Here's a demonstration of my homemade thermostat that uses a Circuit Playground Express running a CircuitPython program to control the heat. I know it's ugly, this is a prototype. This is the old thermostat and with the alligator clips I've hooked into the two terminals that turn the heat on and they're connected to a relay. The relay is powered from the breadboard that's powered from the CPX and the relay is controlled by an output from the CPX. And also on the breadboard we have a temperature sensor and a potentiometer. And right now these lights indicate that the temperature in the room is two tenths of a degree Celsius higher than what I've asked for. So the heat won't come on again until the temperature drops a little bit or until I raise the desired temperature, which I'll do now. Now, the ambient temperature is two tenths of a degree Celsius colder than what I would like, so the relay has switched and the heat is coming on. And the heat will now um, in a simple way, it would simply stay on until the temperature reached the desired temperature and then shut off. But once I shut off the relay, the heater continues to go because it's got heat built up and it has to dissipate that heat. So it's hard to predict really when the ambient temperature is going to arrive at the desired. So I use this potentiometer to dial in a, um, a time. So it ranges anywhere from something like 60 seconds to 10 minutes. Um, you can think of it as an early cutoff, otherwise the heater overshoots and then the, the temperature gets much warmer than what I wanted. The heat's going now and if I change my mind and I say, well, I don't really want it that hot, then the relay turns off, but now it takes some time for the heat that's built up to dissipate.